camera died, so I'm using my phone. But I am here at Carolyn's today, um, and I'm still driving through. It's a long wait. It looks like there's a lot of construction going on here in the parking lot, so I'm just going to show you really quick. I did take away all the Gold Pass parking. Obviously, I'm about to get run over by that big truck, but this is all brand new. Um, there's a lot of dirt everywhere there's a lot of trucks they might be putting parking out here who knows um but they did take away the gold pass parking this year and put everyone in the normal area which is why we are in this huge long line oh and they have a little flagger telling me to go slow well this is interesting um let's see yep a lot a lot of construction going on a lot of barrels, a lot of dirt, some concrete slabs, um, and that's really about it right now over here. It looks like the Gold Pass parking is kind of the bus parking, so we'll see more when we get in. Okay, we're actually going through the south entrance of the park, which is actually my first time going through this entrance. Normally it is closed, but today I guess due to crowds or since they took out the other gold fast parking, they kind of give, gave us a bigger space, which it looks nice. It doesn't look too crowded and you get good views over here, so let's go. Okay, we're now in the park. Um, we are by Afterburn, so it's a little different. It did take a little bit to get in because they only had like three of them open, but it's okay. We're finally in. Um, there's that. Um, I will be going to see some shows today because I haven't seen any this year. So we'll see how those go and I guess I'll show you later. Bye. Okay, so we're in the back of the park now. Um, and this is where the new roller coaster for 2015 is supposed to be built. Um, they do have a little gag right there. Rome wasn't built in a day. Um, it looks like that's when the announcement's going to be. It's coming up. Obviously, they have everything blocked off, road closed. Um, yeah, we can see if we can see through some of these little peepholes through. Let's see. From what I see so far, I see some foundation. Um, see, I can't really see. There's some foundation. There's a lot of foundation. So you can kind of get a good view of what's going on. There's a lot more progress than there was at the beginning. Um, hopefully as sun goes on we'll see some more, we'll see some parts, but that's what it is right now. The thing, I'm going to go on the hurler and see if I can see anything else and I'll let you know. Okay, I just got off the hurler. Um, there's definitely a lot of construction going on. Um, it'll be exciting to see what's going to happen within the next year, but if you ever are trying to see anything, definitely go on Hurler. Um, it'll give you great views and get a little glimpse of what's coming on. This is also something else that's new for this year, Chickies and Pete's. Be sure to visit. We're just around the corner. It was an open um, opening day. I think it's open now. They have number one sports bar with ASPM. Um, it's called Carolina Bell Works. And then Chickies and Pete's is right there. So we'll see. I don't really see much going on. I haven't went inside. But it looks pretty good. Something new this year at Cowan's is they added two new slides to the water park, so here's just a little bit of the water park. Dorsal fin drop and surface swell. There. The green one right there, and then the orange and blue. Can't really see much, but I guess here's the water park. Okay, we're right at the entrance of Planet Snoopy right now. Um, they did add the Harmony Hall this year, which is right behind, in front, slash next to Intimidator. 
Um, so we're about to go right in there. It looks entertainment, beverages, food. So we'll see how that is. It looks pretty nice from the outside. And they did move Ripcord from all the way in the back to all the way in the front of the park. Obviously it's not ready right now, but it's in a very prime location next to Planet Snoopy and everything over here. Sky Tower has been closed for a long time. It's still closed, obviously, it's not moving. Okay, let's go on in. Okay, this is the Harmony Hall at Carolyn's. It actually is a bar. Um, and then that's where the food's at. They really changed this around. And they do live entertainment here. It's not right now, but you can't really see the sign. Um, it says Harmony Hall. So, there's TVs. So I'm gonna go get some food. Mm -hmm. There we go. Coke freestyle, that's awesome. There's the drinks, the salads, some snacks. Outside. The bakery, the burgers. They have a bunch. They have a lot of stuff here. Carowinds also does have dinosaurs alive, like most of the other parks. And they have a new nighttime adventure where you can go from 9 p.m. to close. And have s'mores and go see the dinosaurs. Okay, so now we are on the Dinosaurs Alive track, kind of in the back of Carowinds, kind of hidden. Um, so we're gonna go see some dinosaurs. And it's free if you have like a platinum or gold pass. So, that in free. Let's go. So the path is a little bit, it's very out there. It's not really in the forest or woods like Kings Island is, but it's a nice to afterburn and intimidated is right there, so kind of in the middle of everything. And you're not allowed to ride in the dinosaurs if you wanted to try. Hi! He looks kind of hungry, so I'm gonna go right by him. Dinosaurs. Two kids digging. Some better 